Hey guys, welcome to the session on robotic process automation. So this will be a series of sessions where we will learn in detail about robotic process automation with the tool Automation Anywhere. So if you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to that channel and also click on the bell icon to get the updates on the latest videos. So let's get started. So first of all, we will understand what is this robotic process automation. So for that, let me write it down. That is robotic process automation. And now we will look into each term. So we will look into each term one by one. So first of all is what is robotic? So robotic is an entity which mimic human actions. So let me write it down also. Robotic is an entity which mimic human action right next is the process so what is process any sequence of steps is called a process so any task which is done in a sequence of steps that is a process so let's take an example you are going to office from your home that is also a process so how it is a process for going to office you need to come out of your home you need to take a transport, you need to travel to a particular direction to move towards the office and then you reach an office. So these all are the steps which need to be done in sequence. So since this is done in a sequence of steps, that is also a process. So what is process? I will write it here. Sequence of steps is called process. And what is this automation? And as the name suggests itself, so the task which is done automatically without any human intervention, that is automation. Task that happens automatically without human intervention, right? So now that we have the meaning of each term with us, so we can define now what is overall robotic process automation. So it is an entity which mimic human action and the action would be the sequence of steps. So the entity which mimic human action, that is a sequence of steps and it will be done automatically without human intervention. So this is robotic process automation. So now why we are learning this robotic process automation, why this is in picture. So let's take an example of a task of an employee which he or she is doing in a company. So let's assume that the task is to collect data from several sources, put those data into a text file or CSV file or any other file and send those data which he has put or into a text file or any file those data need to be sent over the email so for better understanding let, let me write it down also task is to collect data from several sources now put those data into a file maybe csv file text file or etc any file it need to be put and now send the file over email to the required person so these are the tasks this is the first step this is the second step and this is the third step so this is the task which an employee is doing manually right so what can be issues with these tasks okay so let's see what can be the issues so first of all it's going to take a lot of time since the employee is doing this task every day in a repetitive manner right so it's going to take a lot of time since it's taking lot of time it would uh, it will have more cost also I will write higher cost and again since it is done in a repetitive manner again and again every day so it might be error prone also right and there can be several other issues as well so we 
we have highlighted these issues but there can be other issues as well now similar to this task there are several other tasks in the industry which are done which are being done with an employee in a repetitive manner every day again and again right so there can be multiple of issues with this so what can be the solution so let's see what can be the solution so instead of doing these tasks what we can do an employee can develop an a robot so robotic software which will do these tasks by their own without any human intervention so we can write employee can develop a robotic software which will do this task by own right so this can be the solution since the uh, robot will do the task the software robot let me write it like this software robot since the software robot will be developed by the employee and it will do the task by its own without any intervention so there can be multiple of benefits with that so let's see what can be the benefits so the first benefit can be since the robot will do the task and it will not take any interval it will not take any break it can do the task in a continuous manner so time will be reduced since the time is reduced cost will also be reduced right and we will get more accurate results because why we will get uh let me write it down also more accurate results so why we will get more accurate results because the software robot will do the task in a sequence of steps what we will provide to it in maybe some form of script or some form of code so the robot will do the task in a repetitive manner following those process only so we will get more accurate results so there can be there might be very very less chances of error in that so this can be the benefits to develop a software robot and we will be benefited by that now that we are familiar with this robotic process automation let's see what tools are available for this robotic process automation since this rpa that is robotic process, process automation is a technology it is not a tool so there are several tools which follow this technology so let's see what all tools we have with us we have ui path we have blue prism we have automation anywhere and we have a lot of other tools as well but these are the leading tools in the market these days so we will move ahead with this automation anywhere we will learn what is this automation anywhere and how we can uh, how we can uh, create the task in automation anywhere how it works so we will learn all these things in the coming sessions Okay that's all for this session and if you have any queries please put it in the comment section below and i will try to solve your queries okay thank you have a nice day